We get invited to a lot of birthday parties, and some of them have been pretty weird. But in Columbia, South Carolina recently, 1,300 people from all over the South got together for a party for their baby dolls. Why do they do this, really? I think it's a, probably a basic parental type of need that they have that uh, is a natural thing. You change your pants Yes, sir, day. change your pampers every day. Look at that. See that new pampers on? Our neighbors think we're crazy. <laughs> and so does my husband. <laughs> All of our friends kind of wait a second take at us, but guess what? All of our friends now have lots of babies. <laughs> If you know where reality is, there's no harm in pretending. No harm in pretending. No harm at all. She's lovable. She's quiet. And she's the little sister that she'll never have. Flower Lydia and Baby Book. This is her first trip away. This was Jacksonville to see her grandmother and her great aunt. And that's Daddy. That's Daddy with a big fish for Laura Lydia. She's our only baby, and she's a very special, special baby. Those are my babies. I love them. I wouldn't go anywhere without them. I don't believe this. I'm Malcolm P. Honeycutt, and this is my family. We have four children and nine grandchildren, and uh, a few others, I think. I figured I'd better investigate, so I dropped in where they sold these dolls. They call it Babyland General, and they sell them in the most unusual way because they try to convince people the dolls are real. And the weird thing is, the people go along with it. Elaine, is this the newest addition to your family? This is our newest one. What, what is it? Is her? His name is Joey. Joey? I mean, yeah. what he looks like. <laughs> You're real proud of him. Are you sure that's not the Doughboy? <laughs> no. <laughs> One. It's a charming custom at Babyland General to give the new parents adoption papers rather than a bill of sale. Apparently, the difference between adoption papers and a bill of sale is about $985 a doll. This is a very special adoption agency. Adoption agency? Right. They're little people. Little people. Got any 18 year old little people? <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh. Babyland General is set up like a real maternity hospital, with all of its employees dressed as doctors and nurses. One woman even arrived in an ambulance, which we think was for our benefit. Everything's gonna be okay. We found your blood type. It's polyester positive. <laughs> this is the real thing, isn't it? Maternity ward? Yes, this is our maternity ward. And Dr. Xavier just delivered our first set of quintuplets. And they'll have to be adopted together? Yes. How much will that cost? Well, taking into consideration the tremendous medical costs that they have caused us, we feel that $5,000 in adoption fees. We don't sell any babies. Five Gs for the B-A-B-I-S's. <laughs> Somebody better call the people from Planned Parenthood. There's, they need to know about this. <laughs>